The whistle has been blown, the puck is down, and we are officially underway tonight here in Birmingham. Last night, really ready to play hockey tonight, and here we go! It's Matthew Newcomb and David Nippert fighting for it! Some hands being thrown in center ice, Newcomb came onto the ice, and Nippert giving some hard punches, and David Nippert's gonna take him to the ground! Birmingham trying to take advantage of it. Shot from the side, saved again, Borver, rebound, shot, SCORE! Birmingham takes advantage of the Cole Reginato interference penalty and they lead one to nothing. Michael Kurska is fired up. The most energy we've seen in a long time from these Birmingham Bulls. Come all the way back down. Huntsville's got one more chance if they want to get a shot off. Fighting for it along the boards, they're not going to get it. The Bulls clear it out, and that will do it for the first period. Go to Huntsville three and Peoria four. But if Peoria were to win and Huntsville lose, it would be Fayetteville two, Peoria three, and Huntsville four. A lot can happen though over these last four minutes. Now the Havoc still holding the puck. Huntsville goes on for a small change. Centering pass, the shot, looking to get off, SCORE! Bear Gundunov was the lone havoc. We mentioned that change a second ago. Gundunov was the one that came onto the ice and he just kind of floated his way. Nobody saw him come on the ice. He floated his way into the middle and the Havoc knew he was there. They dumped it off to him and that was an easy shoot and score for the Huntsville Havoc. And with 205 remaining in the second period, we're tied at one. Bear Gindanov, the assist, number 77, Rob Darer. To Gindanov to tie this up at one. Here comes Huntsville. Another chance, and he goes just wide, loose into the crease, and now it's a two to one Huntsville game. Just like that, in 30 seconds, the script has been. Birmingham with one more chance. They'll win the faceoff, but it's going to go back behind Borva, and that will begin the third period here. Huntsville has now stormed back to take the lead over the Duncan Bulls. Couldn't take it cleanly. Now here come the Havoc, up into the Birmingham zone. Poke checked away, good defense there from Birmingham, but a huge hit, and that's going to be another penalty on the Bulls. Jacob Barber is down, and he is not feeling well. That was a big hit from Brody Duncan. Huntsville is not happy. Jason Lopez, the trainer for the Havoc, quickly out onto the ice. We'll see what the official points of hockey. The officials will stand in between them, guaranteed in between the two benches to end the hockey game. And the two sides are skating onto the ice. Rob Dar shoots, scores! Power play goal for Rob Dare, and he makes this a three to one hockey game. Gerska, he's got the lone goal. He's gonna pass it up to the far side. 20 seconds to go in the Hawking, the shot, SCORE! <laughs> Birmingham making it a one goal game with 18 seconds to go. Jake Papalardo. Down, the Bulls will win the faceoff. Taken away though, goes right back to the Bulls. They gotta get going, the pass is stolen. Empty net shot, SCORE! The Bulls did what they needed to do. They went for the pass across the ice, and it was there in time. Goal scored by number 19, Cy Nutkovich. Goal scored at 19.50 of the third period. Number 19, Cy Nutkovich. Cy Nutkovich credited with the empty net goal for the Havoc, and that will do it here in Birmingham. Still 10 seconds on the clock, but it's a two-goal game. Hayden Stewart is back out on the ice. Huntsville will win the faceoff this time. Let's see if there's any bit of action here after the game is over. Five seconds left on the clock. 
Huntsville still fighting hard for the puck, and that will do it. Final score here in Birmingham tonight in front of 3,700 for the final time in Birmingham this season. Havoc for the Bulls, too. To center ice. They fought all the way through this game just like they have all the way through the season. We want you guys to make sure and let them know you're here for them. All right, Bulls fans, there they are at center ice. How about you put your hands together and let them know that you're there. Let's hear it for your Birmingham Bulls. We're proud of these guys who are still with us, proud of the ones that played with us during the season. We hope they have a great off season. And fans, we hope you all will be back here when we start our next season off in October. So the final score tonight, Huntsville 4-2-2 over the Birmingham Bulls. The first goal of the game came from Michael Gerska in the first period, his first of the season to give Birmingham a one to nothing lead. But in the second period, with two and a half minutes to go, Barry Gundinov put it into the back of the net. 30 seconds later, Jacob Barber made it a 2-2-1.